Okay. Um, next on the uh, agenda is the uh, consent calendar. And as you're aware, um, the uh, chair, the committee chairs can put items on the consent item that have unanimous um, votes on them. And so that you'll see some of these on there. If any of them are polled, they will be talked about back in the chair committee report. And there, there is one that's being polled, and that's item 4.13. So that will be part of, that will be discussed during finances uh, committee report. So get, make sure my computer is awake again. <coughs> so at this, this is the time when board members can pull agenda items or consent items. Um, board member Lisa Cummins. Um, I would just like to hear um, 4.16, 4.16, information on the civics annual report to legislature. And the action 4.12, um, student enrollment options. Okay. Uh, board member Cummins requesting 4.16. 4.12 4.12 to be pulled from the consent calendar. No, is it 4.16 and 4. Point what? 1.2. One, two. Okay. 4.12. Uh -huh. Okay, the 4.12 will be discussed in finance when finance does a report. Okay, we have that inventoried. Um, can I go to another? Are you are you finished polling? Okay, uh, board member Lear. And I'd like to request that uh, item number four point one one four point eleven be pulled from the consent calendar. Okay, four point one one will be pulled and will be discussed during uh, the standards committee report. Okay, um, ch chairs of those committees, we want to make sure that. They do get discussed. I have them written down, but I might make an error, so be sure and help me out. Okay, is there, oh, uh, Vice Chair Brittany Cummins? I was just going to make the motion to move, uh, approve the consent calendar. Okay, we have a motion to approve. The, we have a second with these items pulled, of course. Um, I'll see any discussion. All in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed? Uh, voting was unanimous. Um, we have three items polled. One will be covered in standards, one will be covered in finance committee reports. Um, but 4.16, uh, Civics 2008 Annual Report to Legislators. Board Member um, Lisa Cummins, did you, you want to speak to that or do you have a question on? 4.16. If I could just get a, a run through really quick of what was shared with the uh, legislative interim committee, um, the education interim committee on, on what we're doing with that. Um, I can see a little bit here, but if there's anything added that I've missed. So let me understand your, your question is, so we'll ask the superintendent to I don't know what staff you want to come up to respond. So your question is, what was submitted outside of what's already in this report? or Right. What, what additional information were they given? Okay. So the, the question was, is there any additional information shared that's not in this report? So superintendent, will you? Well, I, staff yeah. can jump in, but um, board member comes just hist uh, historically, we used to, you might recall, we used to physically present reports and then a bunch of reports were um, pulled back to just be submitted electronically and then if uh, members of the committee had questions they could ask those publicly in the interim report. Mm -hmm. Representative Christian mm -hmm. from time to time would ask uh, us to come to the table and, and answer some questions but generally over the past few years we've just been submitting that as required electronically and there hasn't been anything in addition to uh, to this to be submitted, we've just always fulfilled the requirements. Okay, the thank you. Reporting. Anything, staff, that you would add to that? No. 
Okay, this is not an action or anything. It's an information that's in consent. So thank you for coming to the table and nodding your head yes to the superintendent. So that was, that was easy. Okay, we're moving off our consent.